Hey, what's going on guys? Message Reverts here, and today I want to talk to you guys about a couple tweets by Michael Condry that I feel are kind of funny for one, because they pretty much do confirm the leaks and rumors about Call of Duty 2017 actually being called World War II. Now, if you guys don't know who Michael Condry is, basically he's the main studio head over at Sledgehammer Games, and uh, he's like, you know, kind of does like to tweet out these little hints and teases about their uh, Call of Duty game. He kind of likes to make a joke about them and, you know, kind of play around with the community a little bit. So, in this recent tweet by Faze Jeff over here, it's going to be screen for you guys right now and he says to Michael Condry gonna need that World War II trailer soon and then Michael Condry replies to him and says preaching to the choir my man so uh, you know that right there pretty much honestly does kind of hint to the fact that Michael Condry is aware that we know that uh, the next Call of Duty game is gonna be World War II he knows about the leaks and the rumors and stuff like that and he also knows that we've all been asking when are we gonna get this reveal trailer when will you just announce the title for your game and that should be coming out here soon shortly guys I don't think that it's going to be sometime this week or next week because of the infinite warfare DLC to continuum that's going to be coming out next not this week but next week so um, I guess it's definitely going to be sometime later uh, this month or early next month is when we're going to get the reveal for uh, Call of Duty 2017 so I'm pretty hyped about this guys honestly because I do feel that a World War setting is definitely going to be a very good thing for the franchise because I mean for the past three years now maybe even four or five years uh, Call of Duty has been set in the future and I do believe that it's time for a change now you know uh, definitely a World War setting is something that Call of Duty has never done before I mean there has been World War yes but this is actually World War 2 like we've done World War 1 and this is a whole totally new thing so if you're kind of on the edge of giving up on Call of Duty you know maybe Maybe just try to give this game one last chance because maybe an entire setting change will do the game some good for one and you know two maybe because it's going back to its original roots and that is boots on the ground you know just try to give this game one more chance and see what sledgehammer games can do I know advanced warfare didn't really get too uh, you know too much well love from the community a little bit I don't know I really liked the game a lot I didn't think it was that bad that people all made it out to be and I do feel that Sledgehammer is a very good developing studio because they do, you know, tend to interact with the community a bit more. They tend to listen to us a bit more. So I definitely do feel that we are in good hands this year. But there's going to be a lot of pressure on Sledgehammer Games this year because, I mean, there really hasn't been a lot of love for Call of Duty for like the past couple years now. And I really don't know why because the games haven't been that bad. But I guess in comparison to uh, older Call of Duty games, there's been a lot of people that just really don't like the newer style of Call of Duty and just the whole different direction that the franchise has turned to. I mean, I really don't mind it too much. I really, you know, haven't been, uh, you know, haven't really been seeing why people hate uh, Black Ops 3 and Infinite Warfare and even Advanced Warfare. I really don't know why, but uh, maybe it's because of the supply drop system and other stuff like that. But of course, there are going to be little things like that. But I don't know. We have learned from our mistakes for the past three years now. And just hopefully, you know, Sledgehammer Games does everything right. But I want you guys to let me know what you all think about this down in the comments. Do you guys feel that Michael Condry knows about the leak World War II stuff and uh, that the trailer is going to be coming out soon? Because if you guys go check out his Twitter, he is replying to a bunch of people within the Call of Duty community asking about COD 2017. And he's kind of trolling us about it because, you know, we're all kind of on the edge of our seats waiting for something about their game. But again, more info should be coming out here shortly, guys. So again, uh, tell me your thoughts. Also, drop a like if you guys did enjoy. And uh, thank you all so much for watching. I'm Avert. So have a great rest of the day. Till next time. I'll catch you guys later.